how to merge an audio file and a video file losslessly. So here's the video file and as you can hear there is no sound. Only in the center somewhere and there nothing so somehow it got corrupted. Okay and here's the sound which has sound all the way. So let's merge this mp3 and mp4 files using a software. Let's go to softpedia.com and download mkv toolnix. mkv toolnix, press enter. mkv toolnix 7.0, let's click on the first one. Click on the download now button. Let's choose the 64 bit and let's place it on the desktop and save. We can close the browser. Here's the program itself. Double click on it to install it. OK. Next. Next. Install. Next. And finish. We can even delete this one if we want. Right click on it and delete. Go to the start menu. Type in MKV and open MKV Toolnix. Now drag and drop your mp3 and mp4 onto the program itself. The program is asking us to add as new source file. Just leave it on that one and click OK. Now let's maximize this window and let's take a look what is here. So we have three audio portions and just one video. Just one is mp3 and three are mp4. So I want this sound, which is my good mp3, I want that. I want my mp4, which is the video. So I don't need the second two, which is an AC and an mp3. And both of them are inside my mp4 video. Okay, now let's go here to this button. Click on that one, type in a destination file name, let's call it new. And by the way, it will be MKV, not MP4. Click on the save button. Now click on the start multiplexing button. And notice here, it is pretty fast. If we take a look at the task manager and hard drive, we can see that my SSD is writing at around 700 megabytes per second. That's a very fast speed. So this is not using the CPU or GPU too much, but the hard drive. So that's not a conversion, just a merging. Okay, and by the way, 13 gigabytes were created in a few seconds. So the original MP4 has no sound. And a new file, which is MKV, has sound. And that's it. The two files, this and that one, were merged losslessly using MKV Toolnix.